Well, let's, uh, I'd like to start the interview with asking you a couple of English questions which have been nagging me for years. Okay. How do you say cold in English? How do you say cold in English? I would say probably the first word that comes to mind is thick. thick. Yes, but um, thick, thick sort of ends up being cold, like total mean water. It's like total, 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 total. Um, you know, as we were just talking a few minutes ago about like uh, Kauri mm -hmm. or, uh, or Fumi, mm -hmm. and then when I'm explaining something to well, someone in English about something that smells good, I almost invariably switch into Japanese. Because Fumi and Kauri sound a lot better. Smell or... Rather than saying smell or, or aroma, aroma, which just doesn't seem to give the right nuance. Right. Bouquet and is nice, but you, you don't but really bouquet really, but bouquet yeah. really is almost exclusively to either wine or something that's particularly aromatic. Whereas I, I think, whereas uh, it, it doesn't fit into just sort of the, the, the main right. you know, usage of, of the word bouquet. Um, and I think bouquet also sort of you think of something sort of almost blossoming um, in, 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 a, in a smell that right? Sure. You know, whereas Fumi is more like I, you can almost see the, the the flavor coming out your nose, you know. And and, and uh, I mean, to me, Japanese is funny. As I get better at it, I you know, it, it, it's so many little words that help to explain a specific feeling. And Fumi is the taste of the wind, so it's you know the kanji. So it's it's a, it's a little bit more nebulous than just smell. Right. Right. And it has more of a. Uh, a a taste sense, a flavor sense. And then once again to explain the koteri, I think the biggest problem is that if we were really to delve into this, mm -hmm. it wouldn't, it, you know, this is the big problem between Japanese and English. There isn't just one word. You know? yeah. 